Hi, hello. Good wishes to everyone. So welcome back to our social class. See, we are seeking that history lesson 2. Yes. So what is the topic? Great thinkers and new faith. Yes. So, Siranda Sindhane Alagadu and Pudhiya Nambikai. Yes. So, we are seeking that. This is your term 2. Yes. See, already we have learned that is, first one is, that is awakening, intellectual awakening. Then, origin of Jainism. Yes. Now, this is your third part in this lesson. Right. See, what is the topic? That is, unique techniques of Jainism. Unique, that is your special, your separate. I mean, there is techniques means for way. Yes, so there are many ways in Jainism. We are going to discuss about that only. So, unique techniques of Jainism. What does mean by Jainism? See, Jainism means what? It is the religion. Yes, so it is found. It is the founder. There is Mahavira is the founder of Jainism. Yes, who founded this Jainism? Mahavira, the great king. Yes, see, he he born in. Which family? The royal king, Chatrian family. Yes. So, the uh, Mahavira is the founder of Jainism. Right. So, the first way is what? Jainism believes God as the creator of universe. Universe means what? Yes. The whole world, the entire world. In Tamil, Prabhanjam. Yes. So, Jainism denies. So, Jainism. So, this religion denies. Denies means what? Restrict. Yes, so it is restricting what? See, God as the creator of universe. Because, why? See, God, God only created this universe. But the Jainism, the religion, Jainism restricting that. Because people are in such a such dif difficult condition. They are facing the difficulties. Yes, they are in struggle. They didn't get the freedom. Yes, so for, they don't have any freedom to do everything. Right? So they are in strict, still, that is still, they are in struggle, right? So for that reason, Jainism is restricting, this, that is God as a creator of this universe, right? Then the second we see philosophy. See, Jainism is provide what philosophy is ahimsa or non-violence. It is always expecting, it is always, yes, forcing that, insisting that, mentioning that, the ahimsa or non-violence, that is without violence. Yes, so people should be in peaceness. Yes, they should need it. They should need freedom to do everything. Yes, they should always in peace, right? So they they need a peaceful life. Yes, so they need ahimsa or non-violence. So without violence, they should live. They should lead a life. Yes, so that is the philosophy of this Jainism, right? And aim, there is a aim, so there is a goal in Jainism, yes. So, the Jainism expecting to achieve that goal, right. See, what does the aim means? Attaining moksha or ending the cycle of birth, death, rebirth. See, before that, see, already you know what is recycling? Recycling process, you know that, yes, the usage, the wastage, the usage, that is reusable, yes. We are making the thing as reusable, right? So that is the recycling process. So in human being also, yes, in our birth also, that is a rebirth is also there, right? So this is known as what? Recycling process. So we are also having that recycling process. See, we are getting birth now, then we leads to death, right? After the age or after something, we are getting death, right? And after again, we are getting rebirth, right? So, recycling process, yes, so birthing, death and again we are, yes, again we are what, we are getting that rebirth, yes, so we are burning in this world, right, so this is the recycling process, so we are also having that recycling process, yes, so that is a game, we should attain in moksha, moksha means what, liberty, yes, so getting the liberation, so in Tamil that is mukti arayda, yes, so moksha arayda, mukti arayda, Yes, so we, we need that liberty, that is liberation. So that is the main aim, that is the main goal of this Jainism, right? So they are insisting that. Then next one, so James, who, see, uh, who is named as James, the follower of Jainism. The follower of Jainism, they are known, known as what? They are named as what? James, the follower of Jainism. Or known that is our named as what James. So those people are rejecting the belief in last judgment, 
decides who goes to hell or heaven. See what they are coming to say means. See the Jain people, yes, the Jainism people, rejecting the belief, yes, the hope, yes, in last judgment. See they are we are getting the judgment no we are after the death, yes, like uh, Yama Dharma. We are getting from Yama Dharma, yes, the judgment whether we should go for hell or heaven, yes. So that should be restricted. That should be rejected. That should be avoided. So they are insisting that only, right? So Jain people are instructing, instructing what mentioning that only. Yes. So we should avoid that. So everyone goes to heaven. Everyone should go to heaven. So they are expecting that. Yes. They the next one. Jainism advocates the goodness or quality of one's life. So Jainism advocates means argues. Yes. So Jainism arguing always the goodness or quality of one's life. So what the people concern people's life. Yes, the person's life. For the person's life, the Jainism is always fighting with others. Yes. So uh, they are mentioned to our Jainism always arguing, arguing with others. That is for life, the goodness of the persons, that is the people life. Right. So the goodness or quality of one's life it is always fighting, it is always arguing with others. Yes, see for the people's life. The try ratnas or three, that is or three jewels. Yes, try ratnas. What is mean by try ratnas? See, try ratnas means it is three. Yes, three, that is jewels in what? Buddhism. Yes, three jewels in Buddhism. It is try ratnas or three jewels. Yes. So this is this is refers to what Buddhism, Buddhist Bautarga, right? And Mahavira exhorted exhorted threefold path for attaining moksha. So for attaining moksha, yes, mukti arayda. Yes, for that we should follow these three jewels. We should attain these three jewels. Yes. See in Buddhism. Buddhism also they are hard, that, that is uh, it is referred as three jewels. See what are they? They didn't mention here, but uh, let me say that that is uh, first one is Buddha. Yes, then Dharma, then the third one is Sangha. Yes, so Buddha, Buddha. Yes, then second one is Dharma. Then third one is Sangha. Yes. See, this is for Buddhism, right? So, Buddhists. Yes. And this, this, these three for what? Jainism, right? So, both contain this tri ratnas, that is three jewels. See, tri ratnas means symbol. Yes. This logo, we are having the logo for all the things, no? So, that is a symbol. Symbol of Buddhism, symbol of Jainism. That is known as tri ratnas. Yes, see the symbol is it's like a three jewel like this. Yes, so like this. So three jewel, right? So it is appear like this, right? So three jewels, right? So that is the symbol of tri ratnas, right? So symbol of Buddhism and symbol of Jainism. Yes, so the three jewels say Buddhism, Buddha, Dharma, Sangha, right? And here. That is three jewels of Jainism, right faith, right knowledge, right action. That is, we, are, we should, that is Mahavira exhorted, that is urged. He is mentioning to follow this, we should attain these three. That is threefold path for attaining moksha. Yes, mukti adaitar. So, for that we should urge, that is Mahavira is urging what? These three jewels, what? That is, what are they? Right faith, right knowledge, right action. Right faith means that is confident belief, right? Nambikai. Then right knowledge, intelligence, right? So we are we should excellent in our intelligence, right? The skillful, right? Skilled. We should always be a skilled person, a knowledge person, good minded, good thought person, right? And right action, that is right conduct. See conduction, the process, action is the verbal action, right? So we should attain these three. Yes, to attain the moksha, right? 
சொல்லி பர்டி லிபரேஷன் எஸ் விடுதலை எஸ் இந்த மாதிரி விடுதலை ஃப்ரீடம் வி ஷுட் கெட் த ஃப்ரீடம் ஃபார் எவ்ரி திங் ஸோ தட்ஸ் ஆல் அபவுட் த யூனிக் டெக்னிக்ஸ் ஆஃப் ஜெயினிசம் எஸ் ஸோ தட்ஸ் ஆல் ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் ஐ ஹோப் யூ ஆல் அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் தேங்க்யூ ஃபார் பீங் அ பார்ட் ஆஃப் த செஷன் தேங்க்யூ லெட் சி இன் த நெக்ஸ்ட் செஷன் தேங்க்